Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Silent Hill 3. Right, I need to try and find key to room 303. Yes, I will enter the hole. Right. I don't think there's anything else here. We tried the superintendent's room. There's no other keys in there. I could see. Two oh seven. That was the room. Looking into Eileen's apartment. And here we go, th uh, third floor. Two doors I can't get into, 301 that has an annoying ghost in it. Try going back to two oh seven. I've got. To, I must have missed something in one of these rooms. Like nothing along there. Yeah, you're definitely all locked up. They're sealed. You're sealed. Nothing there. Look at that window, no. Yeah, well, I Gavin from here. I'm pretty sure that's room 303. Is it room 303 though? It's 202. Okay, so it should, yeah, so it should be 303. It's 207 is here, and we're looking across to here. I don't know why I pointed the screen, it's not like, oh shit, it's not like you can see where I'm pointing. Okay, there's definitely nothing else in this room. Baby's bed. Lots of kids toys lying around. here. Anything on the notice board? No. Looks like kids graffiti, the writing is so gentle that it makes me feel sick. Right, nothing of note here. Okay, 
a bit of graffiti around. But it seems of no consequence. Alright. I'm just going to recheck these rooms. I'm going to try something. So that's how I use that. I've still got the cassette even though I've used that. So that's how you use that. Uh, check the other side, I guess. So I need to knock them down to the ground, stick them with the uh, obedience sword, and they stay down for as long as the sword is in them. Got it. Can I smash this? Okay. okay. Nothing around here. All right, nothing else around here. There's a second one, that's not fair.
Right, so this is the alcoholic's room. T-shirt. Okay, nothing else of note here. I wonder, actually. No, oh, what's that? Cage, nothing of consequence. There was that whole business with the phone. Did he say what the numbers were? Because maybe I can try dialing that number from the apartment. Pretty sure it was in the superintendent's room. There we go. And there's Rachel. Return it to 302 together with the part. Her boyfriend Mike tore off. He was a tough one. Okay, so which room had the phone in it? I'm going to leave you there. I'm pretty sure you're the only ghost on this level.
Alright, alright. Not even let me interact with the phone anymore. Okay, so whatever we need to do with the phone has been done. Well, there goes that theory then. Blood round here. Turntable. This guy was really into his music. Nothing here. Nothing else here. Okay, so it seems like I've got everything from the apartments that I can get. Well then, I'm at a loss. I honestly don't know what to do. Phone there, can't do anything with it. <sighs> Check the other side. Nothing around here. Nothing here. Bunch of dead, dead those things. Okay, nothing I can do with that. Was that? Has his room nothing in it? Oh, hang on. Is that anything important there, or is it just. No, okay. have to look this up I I really don't enjoy having to look things up Okay. Right. It seems we covered some kind of animal hair. Right, so this is the cat lady's place, it has to be. And there's nothing of note here at all.
Who is there? That was terrible. Open it? Yeah. Uh, it's wrapped up in these torn bloody jeans. It's the body of a dead cat. There's a torn red paper in one of the pockets. Ah! I'll we'll take that and slide that under 302. Ah, uh, finally some progress. Right, okay. Jesus. Nearly 20 minutes it's taken us to get to this. Right, might as well check the rest of this floor. Pay attention to Henry, see if he's actually going to point out anything to us. What a cock tease that, that was. Just models. Fuck you, game. Nothing in there. Oh, you have two of these, aren't you lucky? My eyes and skin are so itchy. All right. I'm going to head back to the superintendent's room, get my sword of obedience thing back, because now I know how to use it, it's useful. And then we'll go up to 302, put the red note through the door, travel back to the real world, well, whichever one of these worlds is real, it's getting hard to tell. He's now back on his feet and he's pissed. Up to 302. I hope this note has something useful on it. Was that Eileen's door I heard knocking? It probably was. Let's just check. Right, definitely nothing of value in here. That's fine. There's a hole through here, so let's use this one. I need to check this room properly out as well, so when I come back, I'll stab you with my sword so I can check this room out properly. And back in the room. There we go. What's this? What do you say? 
Oh yeah, I had a really wicked headache that day and I just collapsed on my bed. Maybe if I look near the bed in my room, 302's bedroom, I'll find it. I get headaches every day now, it's terrible. What am I going to do? May 22. Leo 2. Wait, it's so what I'm looking for in my room. Eileen, you okay? She's not there. What's that? What the doll key? Key with a girl's doll key, uh, key chain attached, 303 is engraved on it. Ah! Excellent. Okay, I now have. Wait, that doll looks like the one creepy guy gave me. Let's put you away. I'm going to take you, just in case. I don't know why I feel like I need to take you with me. Right, I'll save it, but I'm not going to end this episode yet because we wasted a lot of time running around. So just to make sure it's worth it, let's put some actual progress into this. My health should be recharged as well, that's good. Well, at least I had the right idea to recheck uh, the rooms in case I missed something, because obviously I did. Without that note, I never would have thought to look around my room for the key. Why is the key in my room? Right, we'll check this room properly later. Go, <coughs> right, Eileen, I'm here. Oh, oh no, she, oh no! Two zero one two. Oh shit, I missed it. Oh, she's not dead yet. Thanks. Thanks. Did you find your mommy? This place is dangerous. You need to hurry. Get out of here. Two zero. Well, I failed to save Eileen. Are you actually going to emote now, Henry? No. Guess that was too much to ask.
I guess I'm going to take Eileen away. Why did she thank the kid, though? No, I want to look outside. No, Henry, I want to look outside. Eileen, there she goes. Oh shit. This has not gone very well for me. We take it, yeah. A succubus talisman. Card with some kind of frightening demon on it. Grab a red paper stuck here. All right. I don't think I can protect myself. He's truly insane. I can't hold on any longer. His power can't be measured. I was so scared today that I sealed off the back of the storage room. I wonder if Eileen Galvin is okay. She's not. She has no idea what's going on. But she's in danger not the, nevertheless, July 13. Is there a new handprint? There isn't town sixteen seventeen nineteen no that can only mean then she's not dead if she was meant to be number twenty because that's what that first the first that is that's like twentieth of the month so she's not dead yet at least. Have a pit sneak peek in here. So they took the victim to St. Jerome's, huh? Yeah, she's not gonna make it. She had numbers in her back, too. Walter Sullivan copycat. Round three, huh? Well, they never got the scumbag behind round two a few years back. Maybe it's the same guy. Oh, what if one, two, and three? Oh, what if they're all the same guy? What the hell are you talking about? You know Sullivan killed himself. The weird thing is, there were no clues. Crime scenes were always spotless. No fingerprints, no fibers, nothing. Just the numbers 20131. I've been a cop for a long time, but I never seen a case like this. Were. I don't like the fact that the rabbit is now pointing at me. I knew that little fuck was going to move. So she's still alive, but they're not uh, hopeful of her chances. Fantastic. On that dour note, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been sick later. This has been Silent Hill 4. And I'll catch you next time. Take care now.